Fashion is very much about building a, um, a world around you that doesn't necessarily exist in the real world. I think that that want for maybe escape or fantasy is something that comes from the area in which I grew up because, you know, Sunderland doesn't really know its identity, I don't think. It hasn't really got a great um, sense of industry. Yeah, I think it's um, maybe a, a reaction against my surroundings that made me want to pursue something um, creative. I wanted to either do sculpture or um, I wanted to do fashion because I was very interested in both and I figured that with fashion at St Martin's um, it would give me a chance to maybe do both um, because a lot of the things I was doing with sculpture were very um, kind of about the body. Well, Wayne McGregor, um, who's the um, in-house choreographer at the Royal Opera House, wanted me to go in and speak with him. I'd never really done anything like costume design. We slowly start to envelop the body in, in black, and then they kind of, some of them sort of grow these protrusions, um, which are kind of things that are based on things from my own stuff that we maybe have done before, but we've kind of adapted them for for dancing for the stage. For me, spring summer was very sharp and clean lines, whereas this collection I wanted it to feel a little bit more kind of raw or woolly or you know something a little bit brutal in a way. We started with these things which are the knitwear fur. Um, so it looks like fur, but it's actually we make it in a very similar way to how they actually make lace wigs. We kind of started to harden that up by going with this sort of leather. When the shape drapes, the leather begins to dissipate and sort of kind of fall away a little bit. We've never really had kind of like mood boards or, or things like that. It's, it's never that kind of contrived, so it's, it's always kind of taking something, a little reference in here and a little reference from there and kind of trying to make something new from it. The best thing Rick ever told me was to learn how to say no. <laughs> Translates to a lot of different problems and um, life circumstances. He kind of means by saying that you need time to be able to think, because sometimes there's more important things than work. You know, I'm not a complicated person, I, I just like simple things. <laughs> So um, lying on a beach with my boyfriend in a margarita will suit me fine. <laughs> yeah.